We sliding through the town, man. We sliding through the town. Now we get down. We got the birthday boy with me. Yeah, also. Yeah, we on the fifth. Yeah, the fifth boy. Like this motherfucker. Now I got one for you now. I got a six one. Yeah, so that was footage leading up to the shooting and this, that, and the third. I definitely want to say, man, rest in peace, take off, condolences to his family, Offset and Quavo, y'all hold y'all head. You know, it's a big loss, man, um, to say the least. We do got some eyewitness accounts for some females who was out there on the scene. I'm going to get into that real quick. It says, so Quavo was shooting dice, and he was getting his pockets broke off so bad, dude had an attitude, and he tried getting aggressive with the wrong mob type. Not gonna drop no names. And dude got on his ass. Then somebody they was with jumped up. And that's when everybody bunched up. Then shots just started ringing. But they was coming from somebody the Migos was. He was shooting wild and hit takeoff on accident. And the other started shooting back. And I don't think he got hit again. But ultimately his own killed him. Because when he got hit the first time I seen his body drop. Quavo was plexed up over some small shit. It really wasn't worth it. Takeoff was the coolest, quietest nigga in the room. He got hit again, but ultimately his own niggas killed him. Cause when he first got hit, I just seen his body drop. He wasn't trying to say a word, chilling in the cut. He didn't even know what was going on. He just jumped up and got shot out of nowhere. Houston for sure about to be a no-fly zone cause mob ties supposed to be protecting these artists. Now, as you can see from this clip I got in the back, the Migos don't be going nowhere just dangling. You see they be having security and security be on high alert. Maybe too much of a high alert, you understand me? As you can see this gentleman in the back, he clutching. You know what I mean? It don't even seem like it's a severe situation. It don't even seem like it's a time for that. But at the end of the day, man, bullets don't got no names. And it's a cold game, you feel me? Take off lost his life and they saying it's due to friendly fire. I wonder how that's supposed to work out, right? It's all speculation right now, but you hear somebody that was out there, man. That was an eyewitness account. She said she seen his own man's do the, you understand me? And it's crazy, man. Um, you see how she mentioned that takeoff didn't have nothing to do with nothing. He was in the cut. Quavo, as y'all seen in the footage, Quavo arguing with whoever he was arguing with, right? It, it seemed like it could have ended there, but somebody pride or ego was damaged or what have you, right? Because they try to... It seemed like as soon as he said, let me get up out of there, judging from this little, we're going to run the clip again. Run the clip. Now, if you can see by the little altercation, it seemed like Quavo was trying to de-escalate the situation by removing himself from it. And then it seemed like somebody, you know what I'm saying, did a sunk punch. From there, it's up. You know what I'm saying? So they try to say, you know, people is trying to blame the friend and this, that, and the third, which, you know, if it's a scuffle, man, y'all shouldn't get to just pulling out y'all guns and doing this, that, and the third, right? Y'all was just there shooting dice, shaking hands and having fun and this, that, and the third. Next thing you know, everybody got, got guns. Next thing you know, everybody got guns pointing at each other. What sense do that make, man? If y'all was going to get into a little scuffle, it's a scuffle. What are you doing? Why y'all trying to end it there? Like, I don't understand. Now somebody going to jail. That y'all let me know what y'all think about this crazy situation, man. This is crazy. I ain't gonna lie, some crazy ass shit, bro. He lost his life and kind of find out he ain't had nothing to do with it. Kind of find out it was some petty shit. Kind of find out it was Freddie Fire. 
You understand me? It's a whole bunch of kind of find outs. And it's going to be a lot more that we're going to come to find out. Right? Long story short is, they had no business shooting no dice. You understand me? Period. Point blank. You should have been up there bowling. You feel me? And I'm not, that's not for takeoff. That's for the other niggas, right? Because as you can see, he didn't have shit to do with nothing, but still end up being the victim of the situation. That's what's crazy. You feel me? And it did sound like it was a bunch of testosterone and egos and, you know, I got money. And you know how motherfuckers be feeling. It's sad. You feel me? Especially, especially niggas, man. That's one thing a lot of the other cultures know about us, right? They know that we ain't going to be able to come together because of our egos. You know what I'm saying? They know we at a disadvantage because of the egos. They know that. They know a lot, you know, and it's sad. You feel me? By this time, we should all be able to suppress that. You feel me? Especially you being in the position you in. You having all that money. You know, you can go home and be the biggest boss you want. Right? When somebody else got to go back home and go to, to the slums. You feel me? Motherfucker got to go back to to where it's not right at. You understand me? And you get to go back to a mansion. But yet still you want to argue with a motherfucker who is, you know, you understand me? Not saying they not worthy. I'm just saying that y'all got two different, like, like I say, man. I thought the object of the game was to make it, you know? I thought the object of the game was to make it. But yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think down below, man. Say ho, say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that yay, but need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that yay, but need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that yay, but need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that yay, but need it now and not later, ho. Say ho, you can't be playing with that paper, ho. Nigga need that yay, but need it now and not later, ho. Say ho. Fake ass, motherfuckers be showing all that fake ass love. Keep that shit away from me. Keep that fake ass shit away from me, nigga. For I explode on one of you bitch ass niggas, nigga. Yeah, but you can fucking be my waiter, ho. As long as you get paper, ho. Cause shit, that's what the paper is for.